So I'm Ollie and we're going to be doing a race from here in the centre of the pool to Walmart Square, about 20 miles away. I'll be taking the train and Tim will be taking the bus. Hi, I'm Dave and I'm taking the train. No, the bus. The bus. So this was my route. I'd have to run over to the pool train station, catch the train directly to Bournemouth, then change, get a short bus route for the final leg to the square. My route would be more direct. All I'd have to do was take a pleasant walk to the bus stop, go from the empty bus directly to the square. The bus routes didn't actually have timetables, so we didn't know what time we'd arrive. And at precisely 1.45 p.m. we set off. We're about to start. Okay, right, ready? Go. Three, two, one, five, go. <laughs> There's problems there. I think the train's coming. Okay. I have no idea. Which platform it is? Where, where the train is? There, there. Adventures? Yeah. Ah. goes and then I'll be going on Ollie, I think it's just there, I'm not quite sure. But yeah, I'll, I'll see you when I'm on bus. Okay, okay then. Um, team is going to be on the bus now. Um, right over there. We'll give you the minute after which might cost me the game. Here we go. Oh my god, that woman. If we don't get that bus, the M2, we'll lose. Ten minutes into the race, this is how things looked. I was cruising along and was around five miles from my stop, but was slowing down for yellow signals, which could mean bad news. Meanwhile, I was just setting off from a bus station heading towards the square. No traffic, no delays, things were looking good for me. I'd sped my way through from Parkstone to Bournemouth in record time and was now in Bournemouth five minutes early. 
I was slowly but surely making my way through the busy roads towards the finishing point. I bet Ollie was feeling pretty good about his chances, but then... Missing the bus had broken my vision of winning. My early arrival into the station hadn't done anything. And even worse, Dina cleared all the traffic and was near the square. I thought there was no way that I could win. But I was at least going to try. I had been cruising along and was now less than a mile away from the square. The bad thing was, so was Lolly, waiting for a bus at the train station. We're both about to converge on the square. This was going to be close. There is he on it. <laughs> Look who's here. How long have you been there? About five minutes. I've won the first challenge. I think this is going to be a recurring event, Dean, isn't it? I'm literally just about to phone you. I messaged you. I messaged you. When did I message you? Because like, after two minutes, I messaged you. Yeah, I did. I messaged you. Where are you? I messaged you. Where are you? 27. After five minutes, you've got Right? Who's right there? 